Hey everybody, this is Greg Hawks for another sourcing in real life thing a week. And the tool I'm gonna to be talking about is, it's a Facebook tool, it's a Facebook search tool. It's called Searches Back. And the reason why I'm talking about this this week is because I've heard some people, especially over the last couple of days, having trouble with uh, Facebook and, and they change their APIs all the time. But I literally used this yesterday and it worked like a charm. Um, fa uh, Searches Back is, it is a Facebook search tool. It's it's web based, so it's not a Chrome extension. Uh, I was I was actually using this on my phone, so you can use it on your mobile phone as well. Uh, and one of the things that why this is always my backup is because it's not a Chrome extension. Uh, it's 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 a web page, and you just type in what you're looking for. And unfortunately, with Facebook, you have you're limited by what Facebook wants you to search for. So you have to be very general with some of the parameters and um, make sure that you search for all people when you use this tool. I always search, it's defaulted on that thing, friends, but you wanna search all, all people so you, you reach everybody. And like if I was to try to type in nurse right now, search by registered nurse, search by job title, which is nice. And it'll take you, with, it'll pop up into Facebook and you have to be logged into Facebook too. And then boom, see, you've got a list of nurses, right? So let's try something else. Just make sure it works. Again, searching for all people. Make sure you go to the drop down, click all people. Uh, let's look in Boston, because I am actually looking in Boston for engineers. And let's just put in, um, let's put in an interest. Let's put in Java and see what we pull. I bet I'll break it. See, it, it, you have to be very general with it because I broke it. And watch, if you put in this, And part of the reason is because everybody doesn't put in, oh wow, it didn't work either. That worked yesterday. Let me just try engineer. Oh, you know what? I have to use the drop down. That's what it is. Oh, still nothing. Drop down. Okay, so the software developer worked. I was weird the software engineer didn't work. But part of it, it has to do with using, you have to select the drop down because see all this jazz here, it's, it's using uh, natural language to search this. But I mean, you can you can still use it, it still works. Just with everything, you've got to tinker with it. Now, let's see, let's go back here. And I want to make sure that I can't put in an engineer. Part of the reason why this might be happening is because people don't fill out all of their Facebook profiles with, with work information. So um, let's try Let's try Chicago. Chicago, Illinois. Drop down, click. Job title. Uh, let's look for a software engineer. Drop down. Okay, so let's see how they're highlighted. I guess we, we've got to do that now. Yeah, that's the trick. So this is what sourcing in real life is all about. And now that everybody knows how to use this, you can use this. And okay, let me go. I just wanna make sure. I'm gonna to try to break it again. So I enjoy breaking things. Just 
Chicago, Illinois, interest. Uh, I'm looking for a Linux engineer. Oh, I went, I went national on that, but let's see if this works anyway. Oh no, it broke. See, I mean, it's very, it, it. let's just go to engineer and then go Chicago. And then, um, let's do this. I broke it again. So I mean like very, it it works, but you've literally got to look for location and job title, and you've got to use a drop down so it highlights. So being right there, uh, I wonder if OS INT has stuff too. Let's see. Let's just look there real quick. Yeah, I mean that works, but it's I mean to look through all the and then you can scrape it. Data miner. I think I built a Facebook scraper for this. pull that into a spreadsheet you can go through it I mean that gives you some that gives you some information I wouldn't say it's a total loss you just gotta string these tools together and get what you want oh here now you guys can see so there we go I mean you can you can figure out the rest um, but let me try something else real quick So I have three minutes till my next call. This is one of my other, one of my favorite sites, but it can be super overwhelming because I can't remember where to find everything. I think it's under links. I think it's under tools maybe. Facebook profile, maybe? Facebook tool, okay. Let's see. Group ID, post keyword. I don't see job title. I wanna look at job title. Facebook user number, Facebook user number. People who lived in current employees of, past employees of. I don't see job title in here though. Yeah, so that only pulls one parameter. So I would say stick with searches back and, and it breaks. So they must be affected by the API too. Yeah, 
Yeah, so again, search is back, is working. Some of these others may not be, or maybe I'm just using them wrong, I don't know. But, um, you know, there's, there's a lot of tools that do this and I'm sure that they're still adjusting and everything, but um, typically whenever an API changes or something breaks, uh, give them a couple days and they'll fix it. But in the meantime, what you can do is you can use this. Uh, let's see, what's in, uh, let's see Dallas. And again, you've got to make sure to, Recruit is not in there, is it? Um, manager, okay, general manager, okay. Find people, let's see. Let's see what we can find. I mean, there you go, boom. You got realtors and stuff, but I was pretty general with that. So, I mean, you have to be really general with this stuff. So, um, so I've got an, I've got to call an engineer. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching me tinker a bit. Um, and uh, please subscribe, 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 and and share. And um, yeah, spread the knowledge. Thanks.